Hello everyone, happy Sunday. So today's video is gonna be an Amazon kitchen must-haves video. So it's gonna really honestly focus a lot on the fridge, but there are some other products that are just in the kitchen as well that I use that I'm gonna share with you guys. But the ones in the fridge, so I'm slowly going through my kitchen right now and I'm trying to reorganize things and also just make them more efficient and just decluttered too, you know? It's like I definitely need to get through those cabinets. So I'm first starting off with the fridge and I just finished that and I'm so happy with it. So I'm gonna share with you guys the products that I use to organize my fridge and make it more efficient. It makes the meal times, the preps, the snacks, everything, like even for making lunches for during the day for school, it makes everything so much easier and I'm loving it. So I'm gonna share with you guys all the products that I found that I love. I really went in on Amazon. Like I read reviews, I looked at pictures. Um, I didn't just go off of like what people recommended from videos because also every fridge is a different size. So you wanna make sure that you're buying drawer systems and stuff that are gonna fit your fridge. I have a counter depth fridge, so it's a little bit shorter. So that made it really hard for me to find the right drawers. And the ones I found are like perfect. So everything that I talk about will be linked down below. If you guys wanna get a closer look at anything, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe if you're brand new. I post here every single Sunday, like a mix of different videos, like mommy, lifestyle, all that stuff. And let's go ahead and get on into it. All right, so the first thing I wanna talk about are my fridge drawers inside of my fridge. So I, when you have kids, you go through so much fruit and I like to prep like everything for the week. So I buy a bunch, I cut it, I prep it, and I put it into these drawer systems. And then so that way when I'm making dinners or I'm making lunches or any breakfast, anything, I literally just have the plate in front of my hand or like the Benko box for school. And I'm literally going through the drawers, opening, boom, boom. Boom, so quick, so easy, it is the best. The drawer system that I found is amazing. I literally went through so many, you guys, because again, I have a counter depth fridge, so it's shorter. So a lot of the drawers out there that you'll see that people recommend on TikTok and everything, they're for longer fridges. And I, if you have it too long, your drawers are not gonna, like your actual fridge drawers are not gonna close. And it makes it really difficult. These ones fit perfectly with room to spare. These are from Alibo, I believe, and it comes in a set of two, and you can get like two small clear ones or one large one, and the depth is perfect. But just to kind of give you guys a little viewpoint there, that's what it looks like. You also have a little vent for air circulation, moisture control. It also has a drain on the bottom so you can wash your fruit in there too, and it has like a little strainer that they sit on as well. So these have been my favorite and I bought a few different packs. So I have it for grapes, I have it for blueberries, strawberries, I slice up cucumbers because Kinsley loves cucumbers. Um, I have it for carrots and tomatoes. So we are just like all set and organized and you can see everything too because beforehand I was just putting them in these little like containers but you couldn't tell what was in the container because it had, I, it was like my favorite like Tupperware, it's glass, but it has that rubber outing and you can't really see through it. So then I, you forget about things and then all of a sudden you're like, oh crap, and you're cleaning out your fridge, you're like, I forgot about this, I didn't know that these were there. So this makes it so much easier to see. I wanna eventually make labels and like label each drawer, like being like strawberries, blueberries and stuff, but I love the fact that it's clear. You can see right through it, you can see what's inside of it just by opening up the fridge and they are so efficient so definitely check those ones out okay so next up I want to talk about our fridge liners these ones I don't necessarily love and I just want to talk about them right now so I can link them down below you guys can kind of see what I'm talking about but I just want to give you like a heads up because I really like fridge liners because also using the drawer systems things kind of slide a little bit so I wanted to get something underneath to kind of hold everything in place and I picked these ones up from Amazon right here and they came in 16 pieces, came in different colors. And you get three gray, three green, three red, three blue, three white, or four white, and they're 17 and a half inches um, by 11 and a half inches, and you can cut them easily, so that's what I did. And what I did not like about these ones is that the bottom was slippery. I want the bottom to be rubbery, so then it's not sliding around on the shelf. Like, it didn't really do much, to be honest. So. These I would pass on. Um, I want to try to find some other ones 
to try out that don't move around and actually do a good job of like holding in place. So I just wanted to give you guys an update on this one so that way you know not to get these ones. <laughs> I'm sorry to say this, but don't. It's a waste because it doesn't do the job. It's supposed to keep things from sliding around and they still slip and slide. And it, there's like no rubber to it, so it doesn't hold anything in place. I just like the colors of them. I mean, it's great there, but I have them in my fridge right now, but I am going to be replacing them and trying to find something else that would work to what I need it for. It says anti-slip raindrop design. It's not at all. And the back is smooth. So it's just, these are just a no-go. So just don't get these ones down below. <laughs> All right, so next up, I have this deli container right here. So this took me a long time to purchase, you guys. I had it in my cart for a long time. I finally bit the bullet because I just could not stand the baggies anymore and I was just done. So I finally got these. These are the Prep Work Split Deli Pro Keeper Airtight Silicone Sealed Food Storage Container. It also has a clear dry erase um, compatible lid on top that you can write with a dry eraser marker to do the expiration dates and stuff. Yeah, so this one has a divider in it. I'm using this one right now for two different deli meats. I have two different types of turkey in there. I love it. Oh my God, it's so nice and it keeps things so organized in my little deli drawer that I have and I'm obsessed. I'm glad I finally made the purchase for them. It took me so long because I was like, Madison, do you really need these? And then now that I got them, I am so happy I did. They're easy. You don't have to deal with the baggies anymore. It just makes it so easy to take out use the turkey and then put it away. I'm just, and I love the way that it stacks in there and it fits perfectly in my drawer. So these ones I really love. It was definitely a lot bigger than what I expected. So definitely measure, but it was, it's awesome. I'm obsessed. So just like the last one, this one is very similar. It just doesn't have the divider to it. And it's just one big one that you could put like tons of different deli in it. I actually have our shredded meat, in, or not shredded meat, our shredded cheese in there because we use shredded cheese a lot for eggs and like quesadillas and all that or salads. So I put all our shredded cheese in here and it keeps it really nicely because I would just buy like the big bags in bulk and you can fill this whole one up with one of those big bags and it just keeps everything airtight too. So. I'm obsessed. I like it so much better than the bags um, and it's really easy to store. So that's what I use this one for. Okay, so this is the third one underneath that same brand from Prep Works. This is a smaller version though. This one is only a 5.75 inches long and it's a little deeper, but this one I use for cheeses, which end up being, it can work for deli, it can work for sliced cheeses, anything you wanna use them for, you can use them. So I have our sliced cheeses in this one here and it works awesome and it fits in that little drawer. I just have these all like nestled next to each other. I'm loving it, you guys. They're so good. All right, so as you see that I'm moving everything out of packaging um, and putting it into different containers, one thing that you really want to do is you also want to write down the expiration date. So on those last three containers, you can use a dry erase marker and write down the expiration date and easily clean it off, which is great. But I actually purchased these for like those and also other containers that I have that I use. These are removable food storage labels for freezer labels. So you can easily remove these. You don't leave any residue or anything. I just leave in the little roll like in my um, kitchen. There's like this little junk drawer that I have. I leave it there and I just write down the date of when it expires because it says ex date and then contents and everything. I literally just put the date there and it works great. I just write it down in a marker put it on there and then that way we know when everything expires, it's easy to see and to keep track of. So I just bought a big roll of these and it was really inexpensive. You get 500 for $9, so perfect. All right, so I used to have A containers where you would pull it out and you'd have to take off the lid and stuff and it was just a nightmare and they were so wonky and they were also a little bit too long for my fridge. Um, that's, this is like, I did this a long time ago and this is how I learned, like you got to really measure. So I found this drawer system and this one is my fave, you guys. This one is perfect because we go through so many eggs and I buy them in bulk at Costco. So this is the egg holder. It holds 32 of them and it's in a drawer system. So they all have a little nestle at place so they're not gonna fall or wiggle around or anything like that. They just all sit nicely. You open it up and boom, you can grab your egg. You're not having to take the whole thing out or anything like that. You literally just open the drawer, grab the egg, close the drawer. So easy. And I love the way that it looks in my refrigerator too. So 
This is definitely a must have. We all have eggs. These are the best. All right, so next up has been in quite a bit of my Amazon must haves videos that I've had because I've had this one for so long and I love it and I use it every single day, multiple times a day. And this is my sink strainer right here. So I have a really big farm sink, so there's no divider in the middle, it's just huge. And I just wrestle, I just nestle this right on the left-hand side, over by the side where it's closer to the fridge where I prep all the food and do everything. So I love this thing, it is amazing. I use it for so many different things. I use it to wash fruit, wash lettuce, wash all the veggies, everything like that. I also will even like wash like the cutting boards and stuff and I'll settle, I'll nestle it in there and I'll use it as a drying rack too. And it's just an awesome strainer, I love it. I leave it out all the time because I'm constantly doing things with it. And I will also like kind of put some like silverware, like if I'm using knives and stuff, I'll set it in there so that way it's off the counter and out of reach for the girls. So I just, I'm constantly using this product. It comes in so many different colors. I have the white one, but it comes in black, it comes in gray, green, pink. The pink is really pretty. The teal, the white, and the yellow. It's just awesome. I This is definitely like a huge must-haves for me in my kitchen. Okay, so now we're gonna get into a couple of gadgets that I love to use. And this one, I actually, my mom got this for me a while ago. It was probably like a couple of years ago. And I cut myself on trying to cut a bagel. And she's like, Madison, I'm going to get you a bagel slicer. And I was like, didn't even think anything of ever buying a bagel slicer. I just suck at cutting bagels. So she bought me a bagel slicer and this is the one that I have. And it is amazing, you guys. I love it. You just, you pull this thing out, you set the bagel in and you just go and it makes the perfect cut for your bagels. You don't accidentally cut yourself or anything. It is so easy to use. It's the best thing ever because usually what we'll do is we'll go pick up bagels at the bagel place. That's what Ross will do with Riley on a weekend morning and we don't like to have them make it. Ross loves to make bagel sandwiches here so he'll just get the fresh bagels there and then I'll go in and I'll slice them up with my little slicer and then he makes like this egg, like soy chorizo mix and everything and does oh he makes the best bagel sandwiches um so we'll make it all at home and i love having the bagel slicer because then i just use it for those and then also like the trader joe's bagels aren't pre-sliced so it works great for those ones too so i absolutely love it this is just definitely like a must-have in the house to save your fingers I suck at cutting bagels. <laughs> All right, so next up, uh, another must have for the kitchen that's a great gadget is the vegetable chopper. So this one's really cool because it's like a 12 in one chopper. It's like, it's also a slicer and a dicer. It's really neat. So it has multiple things that you can do. You can use it for like larger ones, smaller ones. You can do like carrots and stuff. You can make all different types just to kind of show you guys a closer look. So you can change it up, but it makes it so quick and easy to chop your veggies, like bell peppers, onions, anything. It just makes it so fast. And you can do all different types of chops too, like even to do your cucumbers, fast and convenient. And you can just see like all the pieces that you get with it. So this one is awesome. I love it. And it just makes, just makes your life easier when you're prepping dinner. I mean, like anything to make it fast, things faster and easier, that's what I need. That's how I live because I just don't have the time. Like I'm constantly multitasking and juggling multiple different things at once. <laughs> Okay, so this next product is one that you probably have seen all over TikTok. I've had this, I actually got this as a gift for my wedding. Um, it was Joel's friend's David. He's like, you gotta get the salad spinner. It's like amazing, he loved it. So he got it for us for the wedding and I still have it and I use it for a different reason now actually. As you see on TikTok, everyone's using the salad spinners to dry the fruits. So as like I said, I'm like always prepping fruits. I'm always washing them and cleaning them. So what I do is I place the fruit inside the salad spinner just like you see in those videos and you just go and it spins it around spins it around and it dries everything off it is so awesome so cool I love it and it's very very efficient you can use it for your salads too to dry off your lettuces and stuff but it's awesome so I've been now using it for my fruits ever since I saw the TikToks that did that I was like oh my god this is such a good idea so but I pulled it back out and I'm using it now for that and it's awesome all right, so last but not least, I have, I always get questions asked whenever I'm filming in my kitchen, I get asked about the calendars on 
my fridge. So the ones I got, I believe are from Etsy, but I found a really good one from Amazon for you guys that is actually a lot cuter. I like the colors and stuff a little bit better. Um, but you get both of these in the calendar. You get a note section where you get Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, where you can like list whatever you're doing on those days for the week. There's also a grocery shopping section. And then they also come with a monthly calendar where you write in like the month and then you can put in your days and everything like that. And it's a big magnet that just sticks to the front of your fridge. I love them. They are so helpful for everyone in the house, especially like, you know, if Ross is ever wondering like what is going on this week, he goes, because I do it every Sunday, um, he just goes there and he can see what's the schedule for the week, like what's going on this week. And then my nanny can see it too. She sees what's going on, when I'm going to be gone, when I'm going to be here. Um, and it just makes it so helpful. So we have that on the fridge. I also have this other thing that I got from Etsy. Um, it's this like co-parenting calendar for Riley to see like whose house she's going to be at. We want to make things a little bit more visual so she can understand. So like every Sunday we sit down together at the kitchen counter, I pull out our binder and we go over like our week and what the activities we have. Cause we also place those on the weekly calendar for her. Um, but that one is also, I'll link that one down below. It's not Amazon, it's Etsy, but if you are a co-parent, I think you would really enjoy this. Or even if you're not, you don't have to buy the co-parenting one. There's one just regular activities and it's all Velcro. Everything is made for you. It's put into a binder with little slits of all this, all the little pages of like, you could do like for the activities, like tennis, swimming, gymnastics, everything. Like it's awesome. You have school days, no school days. Like it's the best thing ever for holidays too. And, um, Riley loves doing it. And there's like a little teddy bear marker that you can change the day of the week on. So she really, really likes to do that. Um, but that's separate. So we have our, our fridge is full. It's definitely full of everything that is going on for the week, but I'm obsessed and I definitely recommend picking one up of these because it makes it really easy for the family. And it's dry erase, so you just, you know, dry it, you know, clean it off and then write it for the next week. It's okay, so those are all of my Amazon kitchen must-haves. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Everything that I talked about is linked down below for you guys if you wanna get a closer look at it. Remember, make sure to measure everything to see that it fits your fridge. Um, but I'm obsessed with these. I'm loving it. I can't wait to just keep going through and decluttering more of my kitchen. Ah. I'm obsessed with it, you guys. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.